the anti-theft device here, the brake and clutch pedal lock. Um, and those of you guys who are wondering, I was had a video on how to keep your VW from getting stolen, or your classic car from getting stolen. So I bought one of these things to see how it works. And the thing is, it seems to work even on the bus. It works great on a bug. Um, but on the bus, I was kind of wondering how it would work. Like, you can't push the brake pedal or the clutch. It keeps them in place. Now, you know, in theory, you know, somebody could disconnect this pedal assembly, you know, or the, you know, the pedals off and take it off. I mean, or they could cut this thing off. Um, but again, you're in kind of a vulnerable place, you know, down here trying to cut through this thing. Uh, the steering column's kind of in the way of trying to cut through here. Um, and I don't even, if you cut through there, I don't think you could still couldn't get it off. You'd have to cut like through here and through here to be able to get this thing off. And then the lock itself, let me show you the key and stuff. So, I mean, this is pretty firm. Somebody says, well, you could cut through the pedal. Well, yeah, you could probably do that, but then you still couldn't drive the car because the pedal's cut through. You wouldn't be able to push in the clutch or the brake. Um, but these things here are like really strong steel, seems like. And then this thing here is really thick steel here. And then the key is one of those type of keys where you can't really... It's a, you know, one of these type of things where it's got four things to it. I mean, yeah, maybe you could pop the lock cylinder, probably. You know, there's probably some way to do that. You know, something like that could probably happen, you know. But, and then when it's it's down here, let's say it's down here and it's up here, you can't really fit a slide hammer in there very easily to pop the lock. So, it's going to be a pretty good deterrent. I mean, I'm going to say... This thing is like going to stop somebody. If they want to steal it, they're going to get it. So we'll try this out on the pastel blue bug here on the pedal assembly. Let me go ahead and put it on. It's actually very easy to put on um, too. So you just turn the key. I can't do it one handed though. You turn the key and then you just put this thing over, slide this thing on like that, and then turn the key again. So it's like yay here. And now, you can't push the brake pedal. I mean, kind of, you know, it kind of holds it. It doesn't do, like, perfect job, but it would make it near impossible to drive the car. Um, so you see how it kind of works like that. You know, yeah, you could maybe use the brakes or something, but, you know, you aren't pushing that clutch pedal in and the brake pedal, it would be near impossible to drive this thing like that um, so it would be a good deterrent I think not too bad for a very cheap price yeah I got this off Amazon it was inexpensive I'll show you the other thing I got just for fun I got these two things because um, if I go on the road anytime uh, I want to make sure I have the car locked up you know and I'm gonna disable it and put this on and you know, do three different things, especially if you're going to stay overnight. So then I got one of these. I've had these before. Um, I don't know what happened to my other ones. Um, I think I gave it to somebody. But um, I got this thing here. It it seems to work okay, too. Um, is, you know, there's a million ways somebody could cut this thing off the car. But, you know... It's gonna slow them down a little bit. It's not gonna be like if you if you get a a club again. I'll show you guys if you're just watching this for the first time and you haven't watched my other video. Um, basically, if you watch videos on the club, guys, I've seen guys with the club on their steering wheel. It doesn't even make them think twice about stealing your car if they want it. They're gonna just grab it real quick. I mean, in the thing that the club thing that goes from here to your brake pedal, that's just as bad. All they do is just cut right through the steering wheel, and it's two seconds. I mean, you could cut through the steering wheel with the hex on in like a couple seconds and unhook the club, and you're gone. So it's really totally not a threat, theft deterrent, even 
it doesn't even slow him down. Like you could say, well, yeah, he's going to cut through this with a hacksaw. I mean, this is heavier steel. Yeah, the steering wheel is really, really thin steel. It'll you could cut through it in seconds. So they're made to bend. Where this thing's made a little stronger, it's going to take a little more time. You could use a cutoff wheel to cut through this, but it's going to take some time to do. So it's going to deter them. They're going to go to the easier one, um, and that's what I figure. So I'll put this on the wheel, have the other thing on the uh, so that they can't just grab it and tow it away. Uh, I'll put the other thing on the on the brakes and um, disable the ignition. And with those three things, it's pretty much. You know, a good chance that the car will be there in the morning if I go stay overnight somewhere. So anyway, that's a little quick uh, thing that, you know, this clamps on the wheel, if you didn't know. Clamps on the wheel and just acts like a boot. All right, and, you know, it's like I said, if somebody really wants it, they could get in the car if they got started with this is the only deterrent you had. They could fire this thing up and just gas it really hard if you had a big motor or something and just break this thing probably pretty quickly. But it'd make a lot of noise. Anyway, I'll talk to you in the next video. Please like, share, and subscribe.